day two, Lake St. Clair. Had 1912 yesterday, so sitting kind of in the, I think I'm at 30 something right now. So, you know, I fished a lot of water yesterday that was very unproductive, that was misleading. So they were gonna kind of cool some of that, stay in the areas where I can generate more bites. Because smallmouth fishing is all about being as efficient as possible, catching as many as you can in areas where there's big ones. So yesterday I had some big lulls that are not okay on a lake like this. So gotta stay around those three and a half pluses a lot more today. And if we do that for eight hours, I think we'll catch a good bag, so looking forward to getting out there and seeing kind of what happens. Yeah. When it jumped, it looked like it. Catching them little ones too long. Yeah. Good. Wading through enough dinks to get to it. bigger than yeah he's two frame wise yeah two and three quarter yep okay like a better one. yeah it does I didn't want to say it <laughs> we keep being wrong yeah <laughs> depends on how big that belly is you have might have in there I don't know I haven't got a good look at the side yet I need to freaking turn the boat a little bit yeah cool. yeah roughly similar something
couldn't set the hook around the phone over. Yeah. Say that one's gonna score. Man, the free home grave, baby. No kidding. <laughs> you scare the crap out of me every time you do that. <laughs> I don't plan on doing that. I hear you. What do you want me to put it in at? Three and a half. Three and a half. big ones first. Somehow. We just need one more chance to go back out there. I got one little one. Oh! So there is a bird. Caught a bunch of fish today. I just never had any big bites. I caught two four pounders. Probably 25 three pounders. And I just I don't know. I moved around a lot. I didn't catch no big ones today. Came into this event with the lead in Progressive Bassmaster Angler of the Year from Alabama, Stone Cold Kyle Welcher. At 19-12. Day number one, five fish here today. 18 pounds, 14 ounces with 38 pounds, 10 ounces. He is currently in 19th place. And it is pivotal for him to slide inside that top 50 to keep the drive to win the ultimate prize, which is Progressive Bassmaster Angler of the Year title. And man, you knew this wasn't going to be easy. And a uh, little nerve-wracking for the next little while here, I imagine. Yes, you know, it's, it's definitely going to be. You know, if this is the worst that I do up north, though, I'll be pretty happy with it. So, I mean, two basically 19-pound days back-to-back. -back. Can't really complain about that too much. But I'm in an area that's got a lot of really, really big ones, so I would 
really like to go back out there tomorrow because a lot of guys around me are catching really big ones. I've caught some really big ones. I just weighed in one that was a little bit too small to weigh in today, and that's, that's definitely going to hurt me. But fingers crossed we get to go tomorrow and try to string together five of them real big ones because I've seen them, and I'm around them, and I want to go back out there and do it. We'll try to get through this way and quick and get you an answer, but before you go anywhere, came into this event with the leading Progressive Bassmaster Angler of the Year points, so it gets our Progressive Bassmaster Angler of the Year bonus check, weekly bonus check. $1,000, that gets, yeah, yeah, you get to put that in the back of the Pinto. You're all set with a Happy Gilmore check. We'll see you, and hopefully at the end of the season, he gets a way bigger one than that.